Local Los Angeles Dodgers fans gathered at Buffalo Wild Wings in Santa Maria to watch their team take on the Houston Astros in the Major League Baseball World Series. Growing up listening to the legendary Vince Scully broadcasts, friends Justin Barclay and Cody Lacoste are thrilled to watch the Dodgers get back to the World Series for the first time since 1988. It's pretty, really it's pretty awesome. <laughs> like listening to Vince Scully as a kid, there's oh, nothing yeah. better. So then to finally make it to the World Series. Especially almost making it the past five, five or years. ten years, yeah. Taking in game one with her parents, Los Angeles native Nicole Thompson was raised a Dodgers fan, attending her first game before she could walk. So the very first Dodger game I ever went to was with my grandfather. I was about, a, I was about six months old and he didn't have anybody to go with him. And he was watching me because I think my mom was working. <laughs> So I went to a Dodger game. Referring to the Dodgers trip to the World Series as a gift for her 40th birthday this year, Thompson remembers vividly the last time the Dodgers won the World Series back in 1988. I do remember, Kurt Gibbs, how could, you, how could you forget that? I watched that game with my dad and that, it was absolutely, oh, that was the coolest thing ever. Seeing the Dodgers in the World Series for the first time, Isaac Romero breaks down the Dodgers' strengths that he believes will lead Los Angeles to another World Series championship. I think that Kershaw's back for game one. Hopefully we'll see him in game five to close it out. But I'm really seeing the bats come alive again. They've, they've really they've really held, a, held us uh, you know, in, in a really comfortable position. You know, they held our pitchers really comfortable, really helped us out. And then the, the bullpen's really helping us out too. This year it's one of those things that you know, we really had the bullpen, we had the you know, starting pitchers that, you know, there are rotations working out work, uh, perfectly, so. With the Dodgers up 3-1 in the bottom of the seventh, fans were disappointed when Los Angeles couldn't extend their lead with two runners on as Austin Barnes flied out to end the inning. Confident in the Dodgers' performance after game one, Ernesto Tovar doesn't see the series making it back to Los Angeles for Game Six. I see, I see the Dodgers winning about five, five. Uh, just getting one, you know, get, get, get the Houston one, you know. And we'll finish it off in Houston territory. It would be pretty cool to finish it off in LA, but you know what? Whenever they win, as long as they win, that's all that matters, you know. The Dodgers went on to beat the Astros 3-1 in Game One of the World Series. <laughs>